In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to justify text with Elementor. It's pretty straightforward to do, but there is one trick you have to watch out for. I'm going to show you what that is, and we're getting started right now. Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to another video. It's Bjorn from WP Learning Lab, where we help you get better at WordPress so you can earn more for yourself, for your clients, and for your business. If it's your first time here and you're not yet subscribed, consider subscribing because I'm always sharing new tricks, new WordPress tips, tricks, and hacks, and stuff to make your life easier using WordPress. So click the subscribe button, then click the bell notification icon so you don't miss anything. And if you like Elementor, you're going to like this. I'm currently building the ultimate Elementor course. It's going to be a bargain. There's a link down below to get on the waiting list. So click on that link, get on the waiting list, and you get more details while you're on there. And check out our Facebook group where we chat WordPress, help each other get better at WordPress. Link in the description down below, join that free Facebook group. And with that out of the way, let's get into this Elementor tutorial. I'll see in the screen capture. There's really only one way to justify text in Elementor, and that is using the justification text button icon. I'm going to show you just a second. I'm going to get some text. That's lorem ipsum text from the lorem ipsum website. I'm just going to copy that and add a text editor block. And now we can paste our text in. By default, we're in the visual editor of this text editor. And sometimes when you paste stuff into the visual editor, there is other HTML components that are also added. That's why you always want to paste your text, if it's plain text, into the text tab, not the visual tab. So if we paste it in here, we now have all this text. If I click back over, we now have it appear on the, on the page. On the right-hand side, we can see it's not justified. It's left aligned, not justified. If we click on Style and then click on the Justified button, now all of the text is justified and it's as easy as that. But sometimes when you do this, you will have, if you paste it in the visual editor, for example, or if you use the visual editor to make adjustments first. So if I click left align in the visual editor, nothing changes on the visual editor itself. But if we go to the text tab, we see it adds paragraph tags with a style of text align left. Now, sometimes when you paste stuff directly into visual editor, that can be added. And now if we go to style and click on any one of these, nothing happens. A moment ago, we click on justified or any other option and it would change the text, but now nothing happens. Because directly in the code itself, we have these paragraph tags that are causing it to override our style options in Elementor. So sometimes that is a problem you're gonna face, especially when you wanna justify things because quite often things are text aligned. If you're copying and pasting from certain sources, that HTML code can sometimes be copied and pasted as well. That's why I wanna paste directly into the text editor instead of the visual editor. So that's how it works. I hope this video helps you. If you haven't done so yet, get on the Elementor waiting list, get on the Facebook page and hit subscribe so you don't miss anything. Click the bell icon. And next up is clicking one of the videos on the right hand side so you can get even better at WordPress. Until next time, keep crushing it and I will see you in the next video.